Haven't you heard of the first Nolly TV? Home of Nollywood movies. Mm -hmm. Subscribe now. First Nolly TV. Don't talk that. To pacify the elements, the gods. Thank you, Your Majesty. In much the same way that, you know, these things are really done. That will allow you to marry Goma. Yes, I will pay any amount. <laughs> yes, but there is a high price there. I will pay, Your Majesty. Yes. The price is that, one, you'll be married with Goma, but she will not bear you children. What? No! No? No, Your Majesty, this won't work. It won't work. No! No. Like I told you, I went to see the king. And also I pleaded with him to reverse the harsh pronouncements against the Ogoma and I, no pattern in the marriage. But he vehemently refused. Yes. But he offered to call the Ezem of their kingdom to see if there's any sacrifice that will be done towards the success of our marriage, but with a great consequences and action. Ugonma will never bear a child. What? Yes. <laughs> That's not possible. Now. I mean, which man in his right senses will go into a marriage with a preconceived thought of not bearing children? Huh? Well, we all know that the essence of marriage is for procreation. It doesn't work that way now. Huh? See, it's, you are the problem. Sure, you know, you are the problem. I have told you. Forget about this guy and family and move on. I mean, what, what's, what's so special about this to go more of a girl? I don't know. I have told you, time without number, that my aim and objection is to get married to the royal family. And there's nothing anyone can do about it. As it stands now, I have decided to get married to Princess Adugo. Huh? You what? Yeah. Princess Adugo. <laughs> From pan to fire. I thought you were being sensible, but I don't know. Like sometimes you act like you are mentally unstable. I don't know if you are just or you are just being schizophrenic. Huh? You're not making any sense. Do, do you even realize the controversy you're about to spark up between those two sisters? I bet you don't know. <laughs> huh? My mind is made of alcohol. My mind is made of. I wrote, I can't carry what is ahead of you. Honestly. Because I sense war looming. You watch and say. No? Watch and say. Baby. No. Do you know I have been praying and longing for an opportunity to bond with you? And I am so glad to finally happen. <laughs> Honestly, um, it happened. Mm. But I'm just not comfortable with all of this. I sense war. War. War from who? From your own sister. You are about to occupy her position. And of course, we've spent a long time together coming. Uh, she will hate us for the rest of our lives. And how is it my problem? How is any of this my making. I mean, I did not make the tradition. And I did not ask for things to turn out this way. So why would she even have it in her head to wage war against me? She, she can't even try it. No. Please, let's not talk about irrelevant things, okay? Let us talk about how to plan our wedding and other things that need to be done. Because honestly, I can't wait to have a man inside of me. I mean, I have been longing for it. <laughs> I can't wait to have a man inside of me. I mean, I have been longing for it. <laughs> All right, uh, what about next weekend? No, it's too far. Can't wait that long. Okay. This weekend. Uh, when are you going back to the palace? <laughs> I am going to spend the night. Then I'll leave in the morning. 
But hey, remember, no sex because of tradition. It's okay. That wouldn't be a problem. But at least I can touch, you know. <laughs> I know. A very bad boy. <laughs> you know, sometimes it just allows me to browse the whole oh, Yes, yeah, that's sex. Browse the whole of the internet. Yeah, I understand. <laughs> just wait. Uh, <laughs> Frank, where is she? Where is she? Where is my sister? And don't give me that look. Because I was told she came here yesterday to see you. And up to this morning, I've not seen her. Where is she? I woke up! Is that why you barged into my house? Screaming like a lunatic? Is something wrong with you? So it is true. Adugo, it is true that you and your mother had long been plotting to snatch my Frank away from me. <laughs> Are you stupid? Or does your madness only manifest in the mornings? Because I don't understand you. Wait. Let me refresh your memory because I think there's a bit of information you are trying so hard to conceal. Frank used to be your man. Not anymore. Oh yes, and before you start gloating and uh, uh, disturbing my ears about snatching and snatching and snatching. Nobody snatched anybody from you. Yes, it was tradition that made it possible for Frank and I to be together. Now if you know what is good for you, take your miserable self out of my house before I forget the fact that you're my sister and I'll deal with you the way you should be dealt with. Adugo, you are a fool. <laughs> a very big one. Mm. You know, I have always known that you don't have shame. But I never knew you are also very desperate. Adugo, oh, so this is, this is it. This is it. You want to take away my man. I will never watch it happen. That will be over my dead body. Mm. Not you or the nonsense tradition will take back away from me. <laughs> please, 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 Adugo, please. Take it easy. Frank, stay out of this. Please, I beg. Don't touch me! I say stay out of this! So you can't even be man enough to put a stop to this madness of hers! So you can't. Frank, I am highly disappointed at you. And you, Adugo. You will meet me in the house. Get out. Get out of my house. Get out with your mystery and your disappointment. Get out. Stupid thing. Fool. You see? You see what I've been warning you about? I do not like this. Huh? I warned you about this whole thing. Frank, don't make me believe that you're not man enough to stand up and fight for what is yours. This is not about being man enough. I, I want you about this. I do not want this. Just look at what happened here. Such a shame. Ugoma, where did you get this rumor from? Mother, it is not a rumor. I am just coming from Frank's house and I saw Adugo there. Unbelievable. Okay, but when you saw her, was she remorseful at all? Mother, you will not believe it. Adugo scolded me for barging into my own man's house. She even claimed it's her husband's house. Mother, yeah. I would not allow Adugo marry Frank. Tradition or no tradition? Hey, uh, calm down my daughter, okay? Um, let us just wait. Let's wait for her to come back and find out why she acted that way. Meanwhile, let me go in and speak with her mother. Better do. Hey. There will be any need for that because I had you know, your conversation with your daughter. Now what is wrong with Adugo going to Frank's house? What is wrong with that? Absolutely nothing. Oh, I understand. Frank wanted to marry you. But, you know, the custom frowned at it and favored my daughter instead. What do you want us to do? Hmm? 
Ogubeze, mother, hmm? I cannot believe it. So all, <laughs> so all this while, hmm. you and Adugo have been planning to snatch my man away from me. Oh, of course you know me. I would not allow it to happen. That would be over my dead body, not while I live. Ah, uh, then prepare for your burial. Ogubeze. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I thought you walking with all boldness was just to come and hit me. Not knowing you're just standing here to rant. Of course it's going to happen. We are already planning for Frank and Adugu's marriage. Of course it's going to be colorful. And believe me, you are going to wear the same as be with me whether you like it or not. We'll have to be on uniform that day. So get it into your head. So, Ogabweze, hmm? this is how you are. How am I? I am so disappointed in you. Oh. <sighs> Rubbish. What's going on? Uh, what is going on in this palace? Ever since that Frank guy came to ask for Princess Ogoma's and the marriage, it's been one problem to the other. <laughs> eh, that's because some people want to reap where they have not sown. I don't understand. Some people want to reap where they have not sown. Who are the people, if I may ask? Princess Adugo and her mother. Yes. Ever since the Igwe declared that Princess Ugoma will not get married before her elder sister, Princess Adugo and her mother are doing everything they can to make sure Frank doesn't marry Princess Ugoma. As I speak with you now, Adugo is in Frank's house. Oh, so how did Ugoma and her mother find out that Adugo went to see Frank? See, I overheard Princess Adugo and her mother communicating. So I told Princess Ugoma, so she went there and caught her red-handed. No, no, no. This is bad. This is really bad. Like, I don't understand. It is so bad. I wonder what will happen if she eventually comes back to this house. My dear, I want that too. I am waiting. Please, I have to <sighs> run now. Princess Ugoma sent me on an error, okay? Wait up. So Princess Adugo is this desperate? Jesus Christ. So Frank, you mean to tell me that Ugoma walked right in here and met Adugo in your house? Yes. You know to see the anger in her face when she walked in. I almost ran out of my house. So what later happened? Not as much, just the normal dragging over a man. You know, ladies and their troubles. Ugoma later, eventually, left angrily. She must have gone to graze off for war. Yes, and this is the more reason why I've been warning you to exempt yourself. Get yourself another girl and just get off their shell. Eh? What, do you mean by that? what I mean is, you should go and look for another girl now. I mean, they are not the most beautiful girls I've seen in this town. The other fresh girls out there. Leave these two sisters. Okay. Okay. First of all, you fell in love with Ugoma. We've known her for long now. Abi. And then the father came in return, recommending the eldest sister. Who does that? And you think Ugoma will just swallow it and pretend like she's okay with it? No, 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 my brother. You need to be smarter than that. See, fine. I can't back out right now. Yes. I mean, not considering the long time I've been battling this and trying to marry from a royal family. I told you that at this point in time, no one, nobody will make me bow out of this decision. I tell you. So you're not backing off? No. <laughs> I but, am getting married from the royal family. So what, what, what do you mean you are not backing off? The king has made his own pronouncement. So what do you think is most appropriate for you to do now? Well, um... I will go for anyone the king recommends between the two princesses. So it's not a do or die affair? 
Hey Frank, you are simply unbelievable. Seriously, you never cease to amaze me. Frank, what was the meaning of what happened here yesterday? What was that? Oh, don't pretend like you don't know. It's about my sister Adugo. She came to your house yesterday and not that she came to your house, she even slept in your house and you're comfortable about it. So tell me, what is going on? Ogoma will tell you. Look at me from head to toe. I'm no longer a child. See, my mother is no longer happy with me because I cannot give her grandchildren. Look at me. Time is no longer on my side. Please. See, I understand everything you are saying. But what are you trying to say? You're not making any points. See, you know your father made a pronouncement that I can no longer get married to you because of some sort of tradition I do not know. So I've decided to go by your father's pronouncement. How do you mean? Which is getting married to Adugo. <laughs> You're joking. No, you are joking because you know it is not possible. Who does that? No, you... Frank, you want to get married to Adugo. There's no how I will allow you to marry Adugo. It is not possible. Frank, how can you even think of it? So you want to throw away the good time we had together. Oh my God. Frank, I cannot believe this. You are unbelievable. See, you go, I want you to understand, okay? This is not my making. Me getting married to Adugo is the same as me getting married to you because you all are from the same family. Frank, can you listen to yourself? Sometimes when you talk, I will begin to wonder. Can you listen to yourself? I am Ugoma, she is Adugo. We are not the same. We are not even from the same mother. You will not get married to her and that is fine now. Well, I... I've tried pleading with you and you're not even trying to understand me. Just want to let you know that next week I will be coming to the palace of my people for Adugo's introduction. You, are you want to try me, right? No, you, you want grateful. to try me. What else can I do for you? You go, ma. You take my place. You took my mind. Oh, you for Why are you being beautiful? For good. What kept you? My sister brought my dream. I was looking for this. Okay. So, all right, so, where do we start? Huh? Mm-hmm. Do we need more bags? I mean, okay. It's fine now. Ah. <laughs> okay. Still awake by this time of the night. Uju, what are you doing? My princess, I came to check up on you. You need to go back to your room. My princess, you know that is not possible. I can't, I can't leave you here all by yourself. And you look so worried. What is it, my princess? Uju, I need to talk to you. My princess, I'm here. Adugo Suto will be coming tomorrow for her introduction. Adugo Suto. The last time I checked, Princess, Adugo is not in a relationship. So, who is this person? 
Frank. Frank? Frank, 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 your boy, your, how? So Princess Adugo and her mother have succeeded in deceiving Frank. No wonder. How? So what, what are you going to do? I'll do nothing. Nothing. What do you want me to do? You're speaking as if you don't know my father. So you have given them your blessings already? Does my consent matter? It doesn't matter. All my father cares about is the tradition. My princess, you are such a nice person. Do not worry. The gods of our land will eventually bless you one day with a good man. A man who will love you, who will cherish you, and who will take you as the real queen that you are. God will bless you, my princess. Thank you. Thank you. For always being here to encourage me. Thank you. You're welcome, my princess. <sighs> okay. Call me the gate man. You are wicked. You are grateful. What else can I do for you? Take my place. Oh. Mom, can you imagine? Can you imagine? The woman locked the gate. Frank has been out there for more than 20 minutes. Hold him! And I can't find her! Even her useless maid is nowhere to be found! And, and where is the gate guard? I, I didn't see anybody there. And she locked the gate from the inside. That means she's somewhere in this palace hiding like the rat that she is. Hold on. What you were saying is that Ugoma locked the gate yes. and left with the keys. And left with the keys. As what? I, I don't understand. What's the meaning of that? Ugoma! Where's that girl? Maid! Yes, my queen. Where is it? Where is it? What is the problem? I heard voices. I want you to go upstairs and check if her daughter is there. Knock and get the keys. Can you imagine? Who gave your daughter right to lock the gate and left with the key? And locked my in-laws to be outside gate since over 10 minutes now. Are you sure of what you're saying? And what do you mean? Am I sure? Does she locked the gate. Frank has been out there honing for more than 20 minutes. I don't understand. Does she want to embarrass me or disgrace me or what? Okay, please, just, just calm down eh? Let me look around for her. I mean, I'm not sure Ugumba can do that. Are you for real? <laughs> can she even hear herself? That she's not sure whether her daughter can do that. Ugumba. Why she has done that already? Ugumba. I don't blame her. Ugumba. I don't blame her at all. Ugumba! I'm not sure. Can you even hear yourself? Defending your thoughts. I'm not sure she can do that when she did it already. Heaven will bear me witness if I come there. I will break that door. Did you see her? My queen, I've locked at the door, but she refused to open the door for me. What? what she she refused. Mother, I am going to kill that. I need you to relax. Calm down. Hey, take it easy so you won't fall. I am going to swallow that. Ugoma! Ugoma! Now, what is all this? Now, what's. I mean, who even gave that need to it right? I'm just keeping quiet because of your mother. Else, I would have dealt with you my own way.
Ugoma, why did you do that? Do you know what your action will cause in this palace? Mother, I don't care. Yes, you should know that I don't care. Mother, do you expect me to sit down and fold my arms and watch Aduga and her mother take away my fiancé from me? Of course, you know it's not possible. I am not going to allow it. That is not what I'm saying. Do you know that everybody in this palace thinks that you and I planned this whole thing? Who cares? No, who cares? If we don't plan it, you and who will plan it? You are my mother and you should be on my side. I know that I'm your mother, but you should have told me. You took me on a ways. Mother, you and I know that. Had it been I told you, if I had told you, you would not support me. Yes, you will not. So I had to do it my own way. Ugoma, so if your father calls you now to ask you why you did it, what will you tell him? Exactly what happened. Adugo and her mother will first of all explain to father why they planned together to snatch my fiancé from me. Only then, I will tell father why I did it. Ugoma, I just hope that you'll be able to defend this before your father. Mother, you worry too much. Leave these people to me. I can handle these people. It's not Adugo and her mother. I can handle them. Leave them to me. Ugoma. Ugoma. No, you expect me to sit down, fold my hands and watch Adugo take my fiance. It's not possible. It is me and her in this palace. It is me and her. I want you to tell me why you chose to bring shame to this family. Well, I don't understand. How do you mean that I chose to bring shame to the family? Tell me, I don't understand. Grandma, you locked the gate and went away with the key. Knowing fully well that Frank and his people were coming to this family for a marriage introduction. Thereby forcing them to retreat in anger. Father, you want me to tell you why I did that, right? I will tell you. But before then, I would want Adugo and her mother to come down here and tell me the reason they deceived Frank. The same man that wanted to marry me, they deceived him into choosing to marry Adugo instead of me. So when they come down here and explain to us, I will answer your question. Are you aware that you are not permitted to marry before your elder sister? Are you? Father, According to you. Yes, according to you, because I don't know the tradition and the tradition doesn't know me. I don't know if the tradition is black or white. So you are the one who said it. Obviously, you are the tradition. So, Father, I want you to beg your daughter, Adugo, to please leave my man for me. But if she chooses not to leave my man for me, I will do something in this palace that everybody will regret. Mother, did she know what I went through to convince Frank to marry me without touching me? Now she wants to take my mind away from me. I will not take it. Father, I did not mean to walk out from you, but I have to go. Woman. Your daughter just walked out on me. You need to talk to Ugoma about her daughter. If Ugoma says she's not giving up her man, they should leave them alone. Please, I am begging you. 
can't do this to me. Please, don't call up our marriage because of what Guma did. You and I know that she's just, she never supported us. She's angry and she's doing everything in her power just to frustrate us. Please. Now tell me, how do you expect me to continue with this marriage? No, how? After all the insults and the disgrace rained on me today. I, I, I don't think so. Now, let's even think about it. What if I came with my mom? Or oh, probably my friends, the high and mighties. Is this how my name will be drawn to the mud? I honestly understand how you feel. And I also feel your pain. I'm sorry. See, I, 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 I promise you, it will never happen again. Yes. Never. Yes, it will never happen again. Now listen to me. When I started the journey of this marriage into the royal family, you weren't in the picture. It was your own sister, Ogoma, that was in the picture before this whole traditional thing came up. I mean, your dad advised me. I pleaded. I pleaded. But he advised me that we switch to you with heavy conditions. Okay, now we are here. And all these insults are coming. Coming on me. See, let me tell you something. All you need to do is to go and beg Ogoma. Beg her. Seek for her consent. Because if you are wearing her shoes, you will not do the same. You will probably do worse. Yes, you can't just give out your own property to someone else and look her enjoy it. It's not possible. Let's have conscience. Let's have our mind. Let's have the conscience in our mind. Yes, uh, see, I am giving you all one month. Just one month to rectify this issue or I go and marry another girl. Yes. No, 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 you can't do that. Please, don't do it. Okay, no problem. I'll do anything you say. I'll, 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 I'll talk to her. But please, just don't hurt me. Please. One month. One month. That's all. Uh, see, I do go. I have to be very honest with you. Personally, I told him to forget about you and your sister a long time ago. I did. I'm very plain. I'm a very plain person. Like I told him, ah, what's all this? We haven't done anything and then madness everywhere. Everybody's raving mad. I told him to forget about the both of you and go for a girl that will not give him problems. Seriously. But like he rightly said, if this thing goes on like this, one month just forget about him. No, 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 no. It, that will not be a problem. I, I'll talk to my sister. I, I'll resolve it. Please, I, I will talk to her. Let her go. One month. Now get on that woman. If nothing has been done. Would you? The princess. Why are you here? The princess. Please, I want to talk to you. Would you? I am not in the mood for discussion now. Please. I would like to be left alone. My princess. A problem shared is a problem solved. How do you mean? My princess, I overheard what you discussed with Princess Adugo in the afternoon. And if you ask me, I will say, please, let it go. Frank is not the only man in this world. And since Princess Adugo has sworn that head will roll if you do not leave Frank alone, I do not want anything to happen to you, please. Would you, are you stupid? Shut up your mouth. I do not want to hear anything again from you. Are you mad? Is something wrong with your brain? Now get out. Get out. I'm sorry, I do not mean to. Get out! Would you stop? Come back. I didn't mean to shout at you. 
Let me ask you. Have you ever been in love? No, my princess. I have never ever been in love. All the men that are asking me out, I rejected all of them because I do not want heartbreak. Uh, now I see. You don't know how it feels to be in love. Ujo, I am heart broken. The one man that I have known all my life is about to be taken away by my own sister. And, 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 and you feel it is okay. Everybody feels it is fine. My princess, I understand how you feel. But please, you still have to take things easy. Just let it go. Who know what the gods is preventing you from? Please, let it go. You know what? Sometimes when I look at you, I keep wondering where you you got all this wisdom from because you are full of wisdom. Don't worry. I'll think about it. I'll think about what you've just said. Please retire to your room and don't cry. I'll be fine. I hope you heard what I said. Yes, my princess. Make sure you do it well. I don't want any stories. Make sure nobody hears about this. Don't tell anyone about this, no matter how close you are and no matter how intimate you are. <laughs> because if you do, I will kill you. Did you hear me? Yes, my princess. I will kill you. Yes, my princess. And nobody will ask of you. You know that. Yes, my princess. Please don't kill me. I, I will do it perfectly and nobody will hear about it. Good. Now go. Yes, my princess. Actually smarter than you look. This okay. is good. Okay, so hold on to it. Okay? I am on my way to Frank's house. Okay, You know what to do. We discussed it, right? Yes. Please, I don't want any mistakes. Okay? Alright, just go. Thank you, my princess.
I left my phone here. Yes. I... I left my phone here. How come I can't find my phone? What happened? Did anyone walk into my room? Uju? 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 It's my princess. My princess? I can't find my phone. Your phone? How? I said I can't find my phone. I left my phone here. I went out to get something and I just returned. I can't find my phone. Oh, my princess, you should have called me to get whatsoever you want. That's why I am here. Which doesn't mean we now have thieves in this palace. My princess, we can't trust everybody in this palace. Oh, God. But, but I kept my phone here. I know what I'm talking about. I left it here. My princess, just, just check first. My princess! Ujo, yes, my princess. I want you to go inside there and tell the guards and the maidens that I give them three hours to provide my phone. Fail to do that, I will report them to the oracle of this community. Yes, my princess. Because I am sure they stole my phone. My phone cannot fly out of this palace. Wait, are you are you telling me that you and Ogoma has resolved all differences? There won't be any problem any longer. Yes. I mean, if you have her number, you can actually call her and confirm. Okay, uh, I will call her. But uh, it's not like I do not believe you, but I just need to confirm. It's okay. All right. Hello, Goma. How are you? I'm fine. Good day. I'm fine. Are you okay? The voice. You sound so pale. Yes, I'm fine. I'm fine. I. It's just that I'm not feeling too well. Uh, okay. Please do get some drugs, okay? Yeah, a, a quick one, please, sir. I want to ask you something very important. Your sister, Adugo, is here with me. And she... Oh, that. I'm aware of that. I'm aware she's there. I have settled everything with her. So you're free to go ahead with the marriage plans. Wow, really? Like everything is fine? Okay, thank you so much. Thank you. You're one in a million. You're welcome. Just take good care of my sister for me. That's all. All right. Bye. Let me have the phone. Yes, my princess. Let me have the phone. The phone. Whose phone is this? It's it's mine, my princess. I thought father told you all not to be on duty with your phones. Please, I'm sorry, my princess. I, it's my mommy. My, my mother is so sick. So I, I needed to talk to her and she was even complaining of foodstuffs that they don't have any more food in the house and there, there is no money to buy foodstuffs. I thought they paid you all your salary last week. What yes. happened to it? My princess, my two younger ones were sick last week, so I had to send the money across to them. For drugs. Okay. Would you? Yeah. Yes, my princess. Go to my room. You will see my handbag on top of the bed. Open it. Bring out 10,000 and give to Neka. Okay, my princess. Right. Yes. I don't want to see you making calls again on duty. Yes, my princess. Thank you very much, my princess. I really appreciate My God will bless you. Go Thank up, you very much, my princess. Are you happy now? Yes. Yes. 
I am happy. I'm satisfied right now. <laughs> you know, no more quarrels. And I mean, I'm happy. Come, 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 come here. <laughs> ah. into my room and stole my phone. Eh? I know I kept that phone in my room. Uju. Uju, I don't understand that I can find my phone in this palace. I can, I, can, I can swear I kept that phone on top of the bed. Yes, this person can make me look like a fool. I know what I'm saying. My princess, we are forgetting something here. What is it? My princess, I suggest we go to our rooms. Search all our bags, both the guards. I will call the, the your, your phone number and let's see where it's ringing from. You have a point. I've not even thought about it. Yes, okay, where's your phone? It's it's in the it's go in and the get it. Hurry, 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 hurry. This person can make me look like a fool. I know what I'm saying. That phone, I kept it on my bed. That phone was on my bed. Ah, okay. Okay, okay, call my number. Okay. Princess. I don't know what you're doing. My princess, you cannot operate this phone. Okay. Is it ringing? My princess, it's ringing. Okay, let's go to your room then. My princess, no, wait, come back. It's ringing here, somewhere here. Where? Okay, okay. let's check here. here yes someone from this palace now i want you to go into your chambers and call everybody for me call all of them for me no 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 my princess i don't think that's the right idea if you ask them no one will agree to that i think we should just leave them 99 days for the thief one day for the honor don't worry just leave them hey i must have done this now Thank God they didn't break the phone. Thank God, though. Ah. Yes. Princess, let's go. I do go. I didn't see you all morning. Where did you go off to? I I went to Frank's house so we can sort things out. Oh, you did. So tell me about your visit to Frank. Um. He said, though he wasn't happy with the way things turned out the other day, that um, he's willing to come back a uh, day after tomorrow. But that um, I should go and um, sort things out with Ugoma so that what happened the other day will not repeat itself again. So I have sorted things out with Ugoma. In fact, we had a very long talk. Um, it wasn't easy, but I was able to make her see reasons, you know, why things had to go on, oh. has to go on. Oh. And um, I'm happy to tell you that we've resolved everything. Everything is okay. There's no cause for alarm. And um, 
she said she has given me her full support. That hmm. You know what? If I tell you I'm not happy, I'll be lying. If I tell you I'm not relieved, I'll be lying. Now that you've said it, my temperature, everything is down. Yes. I'm happy about the situation now. Well, I'm happy so, uh, so we don't have a repeat of uh, the ugly incident that took place the last time. No, 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 there won't be a repeat of that. Uh, uh, Father, do you want me to call Ugoma so you can ask her yourself? It's not necessary. Okay. I'm your father. I can see through you. <laughs> I can see through all of you. I give birth to you. Yotago. So, so uh, the event is on course. That's what it means. Things have been bought, but preparations were actually concluded. So for this this time around is just to roll the event, right? Yes, sir. I'm happy for you. Adugo, Mommy. are you sure of this plan? Yes. Mommy, I believe it's going to work well. As long as we don't tell anybody in the palace that they are coming or when they are coming. I was also able to convince Father. Okay. You know, I, I have settled with Ugoma. Okay. And he said if that is the case, there won't be any need for any announcement. So it works in our favor. He said that. Yes, he did. I just pray it works because if this particular plan of yours fails, I wonder what my next action will be. Trust me, mommy, it will not fail. <sighs> Hello, my love. How are you? Well, I'm fine. <laughs> yes, I'm. I am missing you already. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I <laughs> I have informed my father that you're coming next tomorrow, and he's very okay with it. Yes, everything is on course. <laughs> Don't worry, there won't be any problem, okay? No problem. Just take care of yourself. I love you. <laughs> All right. Bye. <laughs> Hello. Yes. Everything is on course. Same date. Day after tomorrow. Between 11 and 11.30 in the morning. Please. I will not entertain any form of mistakes. Please. You don't have to worry. You'll get your balance. Just do a good job for me, okay? What is it? Mm. Who is your route? They know. They know for me. Ah. No, 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 no. This route ah. is from Ghana. So, ah. It's like poison. <laughs> I imported it. <laughs> but it's good. It helps to kill some of the things, you know. Yeah. All these things you do with these girls. So it's like a route safety now. Let's <laughs> 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 go. Always do this. This is why I can't see it's coming here. 
Okay, no, I mean, need to ask him. Since you started this, your marriage class, Mama has been passive. I don't know. Why have you not been involving mom? Ah, <sighs> that's a good question, actually. I do not want to involve my mother for now, right? Until I'm done paying her bride price. You know, and also we can plan for the traditional marriage and white wedding. By then I can involve her. You know, I can't just pull her all the way from Abuja just for mere introduction. No, now that would be so much heavy load for her. So let's just finish the introduction tomorrow. Then I can involve her. All right? That makes sense. <laughs> I know. <That> makes sense. <laughs> Drink, no, my brother. As you say, tomorrow by this time we'll be on our way. Now. One now. We'll blow one way. You know how see they go. <laughs> I believe you there. Uh, if not, I have Catholic stomach. I can't deal with this, you know. Oh. Brother, drink. Drink. It's good for you. Look at your face. Uh -huh. If not, that is it. It's good for... Nah, I'm going to go Please, I beg you in the name of God, don't kill me. Please spare my life, please. Anything you want, money, name it. I will call my father to send it to you. People, please don't kill me. I don't want to die. You shut up! The test is money we want. See, we don't want your money. The so. You don't need money. Then what do you want? Since you don't need money, what do you want? Say it and my father will give it to you. My father has money. Please don't kill me. <laughs> Please. I, I, I don't know if you... <coughs> See, like I tell you, eh? If you talk again, eh? If you talk again, go no say just soap, no come board. Talk, feel, feel this thing, feel that. Have you seen it? You don't see this thing now, Kala, Odu Meje. If you talk any hard, I'll pull this up for your head. Please, can you at least remove this thing from my eyes so that I can see a little? My eyes is paining me and it's itching me, please. <laughs> Hey girl, come on that thing for her eyes. Look, I remove this thing for her eyes. Come on down. I was. You see if I remove this thing for her eyes, she could see our face now. Look. I see me, come on down. Oui. Oui. Don't see your idea, ba. Hama. Hama, it is you. Who goes you? You know me. Who will be? I know you. Yes, I know you from the university. So this is where you have gotten yourself into. This is it. After all my advice to you in the university the day you fought with the courtists, that you were owing some money. That boy nearly killed you that day. I was the one who paid the money for you. And I, I can remember I gave you some money too. Oh, oh. Princess Suguma. Yes, Princess Suguma, it is me. Why can't you come here now? Huh? I sent us to kidnap you. Guys, guys. This be a better person. You guys free her. No, no. Nah. I will go free her now. If you free her now, I won't take all our balance. They question me. Lose this thing. Where you? Was it for course? Oh. Okay. Mm. 
If I hear your voice again. Thank you. 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 What a small world it is. Anyways, you have to be careful. Extremely careful. Because you have an enemy with you. Yes. Someone who is within you sent us to kidnap you. And you have to be careful. And as for your fiancé's mother, you're going to meet in the hotel. That meeting is fake. I suggest you back out. You have to be very careful and watch your back. Because someone who asks us to kidnap you is someone you know. Please tell me, who is the person? Please, who asked you to kidnap me? Uh, why is everything loud? All is well, and I'm glad you came. You're uh, no welcome. To thank you. Ah, she's in. I don't ganga. The dead who hits us. How are you? I'm fine. My brother said he'll soon be with us. Oh, okay. <laughs> How have you been? <laughs> Frank, what are you doing here? How are you? I came according to arrangements. What arrangement are you talking about? For Adugo's introduction, I called you on the phone, which is cost. Frank, you did not call me. Yes, you didn't call me. So who was the person that picked my call when I called you? Look. Oh my God. This was the exact time I was looking for my phone. Adugo. So this is your plan. Adugo, this is your plan. So you planned this whole thing. You planned for me to get kidnapped so you can snatch my mind away from me. Adugo! And what is that supposed to mean? I will deal with you. Don't worry. I know how to deal with you. Now what is all this? I know how to deal with you. I know how to treat you. What's this you can't... Want all about? Hello? Hello, officer? It's me, it's me, Ugoma. From the palace, there's an emergency. And I need you to send your voice now. Now what is this? Ugoma, what is going on? What is now? this? Why are you calling the police, Ugoma? Mother. Mother, this fool here sent kidnappers to kidnap me. What? Adugo. Did you hear what your sister just said? Am I not talking to somebody? Hey! Now what is that? Your daughter just came. Accused my daughter. And before me, you're just asking my daughter, believing your daughter immediately. Ugo, where is there? Please! Allow your daughter to speak for herself. Oh, really? Adugo, hmm. did you send some people to kidnap your sister or not? Now you listen to me. If you utter a word, I will deal with you. You better keep quiet. Oh! So, Ugo, where is it? You're supporting your daughter? Supporting. You're supporting your daughter, right? It's okay. Um, Ugoma, how did you get to know that it was Adugo that sent those people? Mother, you remember I was looking for my phone. Someone came into my room, stole my phone just to answer my call from Frank. The person told Frank to come and pay for Adugo's introduction. That Adugo and I had sorted our differences. Today again, just today I got a call from a woman who told me that she is Frank's mother and that she flew in from Abuja that I should come for us to have a meeting on how Frank is going to marry me. Mother, on my way to the place, 
car double crossed me. And before I know it, three men came down from the car and kidnapped me. My God. Yes, mother. I was lucky enough to beg them to please untie what they used to blindfold me. Then I recognized one of them. He happens to be my classmate in school that I helped. And he told me that I do go, my sister sent them. You got a call from some woman from Abuja. And you had a guard to accuse my daughter. Now what stops you from calling the woman back to find out who kidnapped you? Can't you see? You also have a cheap brain like your mom. Can you just listen to yourself? Mm -hmm. Ugo, mm? Your daughter kidnapped my daughter. And you are here supporting your daughter. Mm. In fact, it is now that I know the kind of person that you are. Oh, really? You are not ashamed of yourself. You should be ashamed of yourself too. For sending people to kidnap my own daughter. Deal with you. Who can this? You. No, it is now that I know who you are. Oh, really? It is now that I know who you truly are. Oh, really? Don't worry. I will allow the man to take it full cost on this matter. To do what? Go ahead and call the police. Oh. Hello, I can you hurry, please? Hey, <laughs> Muga, please. You are a fool. Please, I'm a human like you. I'm a human being, please. Nega, so you are a thief. You stole Princess to go mass phone and pretend as if you've not, you, you've not seen that phone before. Ibo, you. Why did you plan this evil against me? Have I done you any wrong ever since you moved into this palace? I even asked you who you were speaking with on the phone and you said it was your mother and she needed money which I gave you some money to send to her. Why did you do this? Why did you have to get yourself involved in something like My this? My princess, please, I'm sorry. It will never happen again. I swear, I will never repeat such a thing in my own life again. Please. I'm so sorry. Just have mercy on me. You're a good person. It's just the work of the devil. Please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, my princess. Go back to your room. Go and freshen up. <laughs> my princess. Thank you, my princess. God bless you. <laughs> Ebuka, you can retire to your chambers. Haven't you heard of uh, First Nolly TV? Home of Nollywood movies. Subscribe now. First Nolly TV. Don't touch that.